Bella and Will, what's today? The last, last day of school! school. As the kids said, it is their last day of school today. Yes, it's the nearly the end of June, June 26th. We take a lot of time off uh, for holidays and especially when we travel. Yep, and Illinois has now entered phase four of reopening. So you can now dine in restaurants. Yes. Safely distanced from others still. Yep. So we thought we would go celebrate. What are we gonna do, kids? Go to Olive Garden. Endless salad and breadsticks, here we come. Delicious. After eating a lot of breadsticks and our food, we need to go walk it off. So we go to the Lincoln Memorial, Memorial Garden. Garden. Come along with us. Abraham Lincoln spent the first 20 years of his life in the forest of Kentucky and Indiana. He migrated to Illinois and settled in the village of New Salem located in the woodlands along the Sangamon River. Arborist Association and International Society of Arboriculture jointly recognize this significant tree as having lived here at the time of the signing of our Constitution. It's the Constitution tree. As you saw at the beginning, there is a map of all of the trails here in the park, but unless you memorize that map, once you get on the trail, you don't really know where you're going. All okay. trails at. So you're walking through it shows you and has all the little branch offs. See all those side trails and mid trails and cut throughs. We just stuck to the outside. So far, so good. So that app 
super, super helpful <laughs> to help All us get out. Up. Bella and Will, tell us about the Lincoln Garden. It's a garden that's like along the road. And on our walk, we saw two deer, a lot of squirrels, and a lot of bugs. It's a trail that's right outside of the like, Springfield. So if it's really hot outside you need a ref and you need something refreshing, just go to the lake, dip, dip your feet and hands in there. Or even take a swim if you want, who knows. Rate the park, thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs up. A loop in total is 1.8 miles. Easy peasy. Today is pretty toasty. I think the highs were in the low 90s, but luckily probably 99% of the hike is under the canopy, so you get plenty of shade. It's a nice dirt trail, but it's covered in wood chips. Mm -hmm. So it's like you're just walking on a nice cushioned floor. We did also see a heron out back by mm -hmm. the uh, lake, as you saw. Yeah. Lots of wildlife to see. And uh, it's a pretty easy trail. Uh, yeah, there were some inclines, but heck, the kids and I had our flip-flops on and we're doing just fine. It's just a nice little escape right outside the city of Springfield. Uh, just a, a beautiful afternoon hike for sure. Yep. Maybe don't wear a polyester shirt over another shirt. That's okay. I'm sweating too. <laughs> but it was a good time. For sure. Ice cream. Do we get ice cream now? Dairy Queen! Dairy Queen! Dairy Queen! Dairy Queen! If you get a blizzard, that means you're going to be cold, right? Well, we are celebrating the kids' last day of school. So, so they should watch us eat ice cream. <laughs> you should watch us eat ice cream. Yeah. That sounds fun to me. Stay tuned to find out who wins. Will they get their ice cream? Oh. Will they watch their parents eat it? Oh. Stay tuned. Well, we got our ice cream. But did the kids get theirs? Mm, Bella, Will? Yeah. Yeah. Woo! Ice cream for all! Brought to you by the Terry Queen. We were not paid for this promotion. <laughs> Well, it is the end of the day for the kids' last day of school, and Will said, hey, we should have some sugar cookies. So, being the fantastic mom that I am, I said, okay, fine. Let's have a fun treat while we sit and we watch a movie. So we got a movie put on, we're gonna watch Scoob, and I got some cookies baking in the oven. So we're just gonna have a fun family treat before we hit the hay. Touch my butt. Who touched my butt? Don't touch me. Why are you saying that? Uh, Someone touched my butt. <laughs>